folks, off good gear here. We are on an island in the middle of nowhere on the river. And we're about a half hour away from the nearest boat landing by boat. This is about a 60 acre island. We've been on this island many times. I've done videos in the past where we went out camp, but this time we decided to do a little different. We built a teepee behind us. And uh, me and my boy decided to take four days and come out here. Actually, me and a friend of mine decided to come out here for four days, but he got sick unexpectedly. And uh, thinking he's possibly got the flu, he does not have corona. So my boy came with me, and uh, so we kind of changed it up a little bit. He wanted to come out and do some catfishing with me. We're going to be setting limb lines out later today. And hopefully tonight and tomorrow we'll be bringing in the catfish. Um, I actually was going to film putting this up behind us, but we got out here and my screen on my phone decided to go black where it took forever before we got the screen to come on. We actually had to wait till we got the TP built and we was putting the gear inside the TP and my son looked down, he could barely see the screen. And uh, he handed it to me and I was able to unlock my screen and then turn the color back on. So phone's up and working again. But uh, we're going to be out here for four days. We're, we're going to be doing some cat, serious catfishing and uh, doing some limb lining. We put this, we found a bunch of, uh, this island, we, we had a bad hurricane come through here. So we had a lot of stuff that was knocked over, laid on the ground. So we was able to stand this makeshift teepee up. We do have a 60% chance of rain for tonight. I think they said we could get up to an inch. So where we're located at, we're not going to flood. And uh, I did carry a 18 by 20 canvas. If you look on the back side, we got a canvas on the, on the north side. So we're facing south, looking this direction. So uh, we should stay fairly dry without a problem. And uh, here in a little while, we're gonna have a, uh, we're gonna be doing a uh, bonfire inside. We're gonna cook supper inside the teepee and see how that works. We're not gonna put a big fire in here. We just want a small fire because it's supposed to be down in the low 40s tonight. And uh, overall, it's been a great day. We got here early this morning. And I say early this morning, you know, I got my wife to drop us off the boat landing. We ate breakfast and it was nine ish or so when we got out here. And just a minute, son. And uh, so we, uh, we decided to get out here halfway early. By the time we got out here, it was between 10 and 1030. And we hiked in probably, uh, I'll say a half mile from the boat. And I, I brought a little more gear than I normally would have bring. Um, with my 14 year old son, he brought so much gear. I brought so much gear, but I, we're not like living off the land while we're here, but we did, we didn't bring a lot of food because we're figuring on eating some fish, but I did bring a bag of potatoes, a couple onions, and, uh, I got coffee, I got tea, you know, this kind of thing. We brought, we brought some water with us, some clean well water, but we are going to try to filter some, uh, river water later and make our coffee and cocoa with it for this evening because we're going to have to go sparingly on the wa clean water that we did bring just for our drinking water. And uh, overall, I mean, we're, we're doing good. Uh, I think if we get a good rain, I think we'll stay dry. And uh, the rest of the weekend is going to be absolutely beautiful. This is actually Friday. Um, I closed the shop early today, and uh, me and the boy came out here, and we're looking forward to getting a lot of fishing in and getting a lot of video time in. And if we get a bunch of fish, we'll be shooting video on that as well. And uh, my son, Ben, he has a YouTube channel. It's uh, Bushcrafting Ben. And uh, he has grown a lot since his first couple videos he's got out there. But hopefully here in another couple weeks, he'll be shooting videos of on the water. island that he can go through. And uh, I'm rolling, so come on in front of the camera and say hi to everybody and hi to your viewers on your channel as well because you can let everybody know you'll be doing some videos yourself later you know you got some water yep there's the camera this is my son ben this is his channel's bushcrafting is it benjamin mall or ben ben mall it's ben mall bushcrafting ben mall, bushcrafting ben mall. and uh like i say we're just out here to 
kind of get away. You know, it's been a while since we got to do this. We've had a lot go on this year. There's been there's been a lot of deaths in our area, and uh, we're just trying to enjoy the weekend because we decided to take four days off and just say, you know what, we're going to come out here and we're going to do what we what we're intended to do. And uh, if you would go, make sure that camera is looking at me. Make sure you can see me the whole thing. And I'd hate to have to go through all this over again. And uh, don't touch anything. <laughs> okay, so we're all where we need to be. I'll take you inside here in a minute, show you the teepee. And here is the teepee. There's up. Do a quick walk around. Yes, you see my electric chainsaw. I've got bad arthritis, so I'm not going to cut all these little twigs off with a little handsaw. I just can't do it. But if I had to, I could. But for the most part, I think we're going to stay pretty dry. We got to say we got a canvas on the outside of this, so it should work pretty good. Give you a view out. There's water over there. If you, I don't know if you can see over there or not, but there is water. This island is very long. There's the river over there. One side is an oxbow, and the other side is a river. So, you can see we're out in the middle of nowhere. Y'all have a great day. Bye.